esterno liquini, dio tiosi, multum lucimus in meis tabellis. Ut convenerat esse delicatos, scribens versiculos, uterque nostrum ludebat, numero mod voc, mod viloc, redens mutua per io quatque vinum. At qui link abi tuo lepore in census licini, faceti isque. Ut nec me misserum cibus juaret, nec somnus tegeret quiet ocellos. Sed tot in domitus furore lecto versarer, cupiens videre lucem, ut tecum loquerer, Simul cut essen. At de fessa labore membra posquam semimortua lectulo iacebant, hoc iucunde tibi poema feci. Ex quo perspiceres meum dolore. Nunc audax caesis, precesque nostras oramus caue despoas ocelle. Ne poenas nemesis reposcat a te. Est uemens dea, laider hanc caueto. Yesterday, Licinius, having a day of leisure, we composed copiously in my writing tablets. As it had been agreed they would be on the theme of love, writing little verses, each of us would compose, now in this meter, now in that, reciting back and forth amid the joking and the wine. And from there I went away, set aflame by your charm, Licinius, and your keen sense of humor, so that neither food could help me in my miserable state, nor sleep cover my eyes with rest. But unrestrained, with mad excitement, I tossed and turned on the entire bed, longing to see the light of day, that I might speak with you, that I might be together with you. But after my limbs, grown weary from distress, were lying there, half dead, on the little couch, this poem, my delight, I made for you, from which you might perceive clearly my affliction. Now take heed lest you be presumptuous, and be careful, we pray, light of my eye, that you not despise our requests, lest Nemesis demand harsh penalties from you. She is a vehement goddess. Take care not to offend her.